welcome back to Travel Camp Explore. This is the next video in our series from our Greenland and Iceland cruise on board the Celebrity Summit. In this video you'll see us explore around Iceland by car on our first day in Reykjavik. So we disembarked the Celebrity Summit early in the morning. There is a taxi stand located directly in the port area right next to the ship so we were able to get a taxi ride over to the car rental place to pick up our rental. At this point we didn't really have any firm plans, we just kind of drove out of Reykjavik and out into the national park area and pulled over at a couple of different viewing points. Eventually we stumbled across a very cool little cafe hidden off the main road. So when you need a bathroom when you're in the middle of Iceland, what do you do? Turn down a side road. Well, make a U-turn, then turn left. Well, parking lot from you, but I don't see where we... Oh, look at this, this looks really dubious. Got a fake lion outside. Well, it looks like it's right there. So, so as you can see, there was a small parking area, then a path down to a very cool little building. The cafe area was like in a glass enclosure. This was a little hidden gem. There were only a few tables, but the service was fantastic, and the chocolate cake was great. So the next stop was an area with a very high ridge with several waterfalls coming off that ridge. So next to the largest of the falls there was a parking area where a small parking fee did apply. We stopped and took a short walk up to the fall, the name of which is on the screen now. We got back into the car, headed back down the road, and only a few minutes later we found another waterfall. So we're at another waterfall for the day. I think this is like a 27th. Not walking to the top of this one. Our next stop was a black sand beach. 
It was very cold here with the wind whipping off the ocean and it was raining pretty heavily too as we left. The cliffs, caves and rock formations were all very impressive. The black sand was unique and not something I've ever seen before in person. The weather here got worse the further you walked out onto the headland. And as you can see there were some pretty large waves rolling in and they almost caught me on more than one occasion. When you got closer to the rock formations, you could see that it was made up of these columns. Very, very cool looking. So after the Black Sand Beach, we drove back towards our hotel, back in Reykjavik. Along the way, we passed some hot springs. On the way back to the hotel, we actually stopped at KFC of all places. We stayed in the Hotel Lotus back in Reykjavik. As you can see, this was a very clean, ultra-modern hotel. But it had some really nice amenities. The shower was fantastic and it was in a good location.